we're gonna play a little diesel pickup kickball. See that giant beach ball? Something that happened in March 2020 nearly ruined the Diesel brothers. Yes, we're talking about their never-ending history with lawsuits. But the lawsuit of 2020 was something else. They were charged nearly $2 million by the state of Utah for allegedly polluting the air. It's not their first encounter with getting charged, but it surely was the heftiest one. Also, in the year 2016, they found themselves sued by a group of doctors. It was after the Diesel Brothers gave away their luckiest fan, a customized truck, but without proper pollution control devices. I guess they're not good learners. Stay with us until the end to know the real truth of Diesel Brothers lawsuits. Buying used, battered and worn down trucks and then turning them into brand new vehicles was the one prime motive of the Diesel Brothers. Not only the pranks and the dangerous stunts they played did attract the audience, but to my belief it was all to the giveaways. Yes, they used to give away their lucky fan a custom designed truck. They wouldn't have been on TV if it wasn't for the TV host and car enthusiast Jay Leno. He was impressed by the videos they used to make on YouTube and Facebook. You'll be shocked to know that they brushed off Jay when his team contacted them for a show. Yup, you heard it right. When Jay Leno's team first approached them for a show on Disney, they declined it. It was because they could not believe that they were being approached by a legit TV label. They thought they were being scammed. It took two years for Disney to convince them that they were a legit deal. After knowing that Disney was asking them to give them their reality show, only to make the same video that they did earlier, they could not say no. I mean, who could? The Diesel brothers have a big history of lawsuits. We surely do not know when the series of lawsuits is going to end, but we do know when it all started. It was 2016 when the Diesel brothers found themselves sued by a local group of doctors. Their company, Diesel Sellers, was sued by a group of 450 physicians, 3,500 regular citizens residing in Utah. Their concern was regarding the air quality, which was getting worse because of the Diesel brothers. The lawsuit was based on the modification of vehicles which polluted the air. They used to temper the emission control system of their vehicles they modified. Not only that, they also used to sell tools which helped others to do the same. After four years of the verdict, justice was served. They were found guilty and were asked to submit a fine of $1.2 million. Seeing the hefty fine the Diesel brothers paid and the COVID situation made fans believe that the show would come to an end. But going against the popular assumption, the brothers did bounce back. Another lawsuit they were involved in was with the Italian fashion clothing company Diesel. In 2017, the Diesel Brothers found themselves in another legal battle by the popular brand of the same name. Instead of settling the whole situation out of court, they converted it into a whole trademark case. It all started when the Diesel Brothers started selling merchandise for their company DPG. The merch included clothes, which was the main cause of the lawsuit. The representative of the luxury brand claimed that they were intentionally creating confusion by using the same colors and fonts. They also claimed that the Diesel Brothers were banking on their popularity. They believed that the Diesel Brothers violated trademark infringement and dilution laws. To all this, the Diesel Brothers decided not to respond at all, which made the Italian brand the winner of the lawsuit. And because of this, the DPG's trademark never got registered. They did have lots of problems while establishing, but it is not all that they are. They were also an inspiration to a large community. They started from scratch and made it to the top. All their life journey is written in a book that they published. The name of the book is The Diesel Brothers, A Truck and Awesome Guide to Trucks and Life. Along with their life journey, they've also shared some business tips and how to manage obstacles along the way. The Diesel Brothers aired till 2022 with no news of the next season. Fans are wondering if the show will face its full stop, but nothing can be said. While you wait for the next season, you can watch all the old episodes on Amazon Prime. And there you have it folks, a look at the real truth of Diesel Brothers. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like, share and subscribe to our channel. Hit that bell icon too, so you never miss an update from us.